Hi Aquarius, how are you guys doing? Welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for all of your love and support and for subscribing to my channel as well as my second vlog channel. I truly appreciate it. And Aquarius, today we are going to find out what does your person in love secretly think about you? Spirits and angels, please show me. Aquarius person, what do they secretly think about Aquarius? Show me more. They secretly think that you're not telling them that you actually may want to, you know, reconcile. Like it's half-half though, 50-50. All right, Chris, please bear in mind that roles can be reversed here. They also secretly think that you are very upset with them. Perhaps there's a very, there's a vengeance, like vengeful energy here, vindictive energy here as well. They may maybe secretly think that, you know, you're angry with them or that you are feeling kind of vindictive towards them and that the Six of Cups in reverse, uh, um, they think that you don't have good memories about them in the past or maybe they themselves also did not have certain good memories in regards to what happened between the two of you. This is definitely somebody you are in separation with. Like, um, they can be an Aries, Sagittarius, Leo, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Somebody like you are, but strong fire sign I'm seeing here, okay, as well as water. The hangman in reverse and the eight of swords in reverse. They think that you are releasing yourself from them because you're unhappy with them. Um, it's almost like they, they think that you want them all to yourself, but you're not actually getting that from them. This is what I'm seeing here. Okay, Chris, what do you think? Not, that's not what I think. But um, Ace of Swords here, they, um, they think that you are very decisive. Mm. Also, you speak the truth. They secretly think that maybe you could have cut them off and you are very serious about that. At least wanting them to know that you are serious. But deep down, maybe you are still kind of like one foot in and one foot out. Okay. Let's see more. They secretly think that you're purposely ignoring them with the King of Wands in reverse and they think you're really sad right now and that you are stressing out in regards to them. Also, they feel like they they think that maybe you... I'm hearing ultimatum as well, giving them an ultimatum, but a little bit of a passive-aggressive energy. They think that maybe you are passive-aggressive. Okay, Two of Swords in reverse. Mm. They secretly think that you have made a choice to not return to them, okay, to cut them off. And with the Hermit here, let's see. Yeah, they think that you are in, uh, in isolation right now. They also secretly think that they need to reflect on themselves, on what had happened in the past with the Judgment here of first. Uh, they think that they've done something wrong, okay? They may have uh, made a wrong judgment call in the past. Whether they tell you that or not, but deep down they, they know, they know. They think that they have done something wrong or made the wrong judgment call. But they also secretly think that you will never return to them. It's almost like you are very serious about, again, not returning, not reconciling, but at the same time, they feel like you haven't completely moved on yet, okay? Six of Pentacles and Reverse, they secretly think that this is not fair, okay? That you're not being fair to them. And also, we've got the Five of Pentacles here. They secretly think that you're actually, again, you're suffering and that you're not happy about this um, separation. Hmm. They also think that maybe you have left them or abandoned them or that, again, this is not fair. Who knows, uh, roles can be reversed. Okay, Aquarius, let's see more. Okay, so they think that you've stolen their heart. Okay, <laughs> Seven of Swords and Ace of Cups here. And they also think that although you, it's almost like they know that you have feelings for them, but then you're, you're moving on anyway. We've got the Ten of Cups here. They secretly think that you actually want to be with them long term, perhaps, you know, take the relationship to the next level, get married, have children. But for some reason, it's like it didn't happen. For some of you, maybe you could have been married to this person or have children. 
but um, for those of you who don't who aren't married to this person it does look like they secretly think that you want them for yourself and you want them to you know to have this long-term relationship hmm let's see more You also secretly think that maybe you can be a little bit manipulative with the magician here. Please don't get mad uh, at me for saying this. I'm just reading the cards, all right? And the Knight of Swords in reverse. They also secretly think that maybe you're not telling them the truth and you're, you know, twisting your words. But they do, uh, they they think you're a very attractive queen of wands for some reason. <laughs> uh, again, it, it feels like a little bit twisted here as well. It's like they like that that part of you that you know okay okay so nobody is perfect right so they 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 like actually they're attracted to your imperfections uh, as much as they are attracted to you it's like the positives and the negatives and i know this sounds cheesy but for some reason they like that you are not like perfect and whatever that it's you know for other people for them they may you or them may see it as imperfect but for them, it's like that's what gets them going. That's what makes them extra attracted to, uh, towards you. I don't know. I hope that makes sense to you. Not all pentacles in reverse. They secretly think that maybe you have somebody else, okay, in mind besides them. Maybe there is somebody uh, on a down low that you may not tell them. Mm -hmm. Again, roles can be reversed in this reading. The tower is in reverse. Yeah, they could be secretly planning as well on a return, undo the damages that they have done to this connection. They, secret, they could also be thinking about offering you a new beginning. Ace of Pentacles, Ace of Wands here. A little bit of a competition vibe. I know there are no Five of Wands here, but I'm just sensing a little bit of uh, competition. Like either they're competing with you or that they feel like they need to compete with somebody else. On the down low, they think that you have somebody else, okay? And also, they secretly think that you are the empress. Mm -hmm. That you are somebody they want to be with long term. Get married or take this relationship to the next level. Some of you, are, if you're already married, then they know. <laughs> For sure, you are the mother or the father of the children or their wife or their husband. But they secretly think that you are very beautiful. You're everything to them, actually, uh, Aquarius, whether they tell you that or not. But they also think that you may have somebody else. All right, Aquarius, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave you with three videos on screen. You can choose whichever one you want to watch next if you want to. Nothing else, Aquarius. I hope to see you tomorrow at your next reading. Bye.